guys welcome to this pre-recorded video my name is Misty and I am a reseller I am in the Carolinas and uh, just an old country girl and uh, thanks for tuning in if you're new please subscribe and register with me all right I got a very kind nice community here and you can register with me. The info will be in the description of this video. And everything that I need and all things like that. So I hope you guys are doing good today. I am not having a live sale tonight. Usually I do on Wednesday night, 7.30 p.m. Eastern. But tonight I'm not. But I'm bringing you this pre-recorded video of purses and some jewelry i hope you'll find something you like please just order by making a comment and the first one with the quickest time stamp i will go by that and i invoice on sundays for those of you not familiar i use pirate ship shipping is not included on the prices and let's see if there's anything. Also, please join me Saturday night, 8.30 p.m. Eastern, for my next live sale. So, welcome, and welcome to my friends of old. Y'all, I love these retro vintage earrings I found here. I wore them just for y'all in this little video. Please excuse this mop. I'm letting my gray grow out, and you may know this. Gray has a mind of its own. So, let me show you these earrings here. I think they're awesome. This one has a little uh, fading on it and everything, but just wonderful. <laughs> I love them. So, I hope they're fun to look at. They sure are eye candy, if you ask me. All right, so let's get started with these purses, okay? Okay, number one. Hopefully, I get everything in here before the video ends. Number one is a small, uh, gray, shiny purse here by the sack. There is your hang tag. Super cute little bag here. Y'all, I'm going to turn off this fan. It's making a, a noise. Super cute little bag here. Inside is also gray. I love this sack personally. It's one of my favorite uh, brands. And you just got a gray liner inside there, a zip, and some card holders, slip pockets here. Nice and clean. And that is number one the gray purse by the sack. And this one is at 30 $30. It's in mint, perfect, brand new condition. Okay? Number two is also a gray purse. It is a large one. It is a exclusively by Tiffany and Fred. A cowhide leather. And as you can see, this is a brand new purse. Gold tone accessory or hardware there. This would make a great gift or if you wanted to treat yourself. Okay? So, I don't want to take all of the paper out of it here. Now, this is not marked on the purse by Tiffany and Fred. So, I cannot 100% say it is also not on its zipper. Um, you know, I'm not a professional, so sometimes you do get purses that are not authentic, okay? So, I'm just showing you the purse. If you like it, have at it, but I do want to make, you know, all, any information I have about the purse, give that to you. Uh, you've got a zip right here. That is a black, very soft interior. It's a very large purse. You've got a zip in the middle here. And on the other side, you have some slip covers here. I'm trying to get that light right in there, y'all. Okay. So this is a nice 
brand new purse. Please keep in mind, I'm telling you everything I know as is. There's your strap. And this one is number two. And I'm asking $28. $28 just because I cannot prove its authenticity. But that's probably backwards. You can see her what we've got. Okay. Still a gorgeous, brand new, nice purse. It is cool and buttery. I really love this one. Okay, that's number two. Number three. Put my tag in there, y'all. Cannot wait to see y'all for my live sale on Saturday night. Whoops. Number three. What do we have? We have a beautiful coral color. Francisco Baisi. I may be saying that right. Okay. Now, this one is number three, and I'm asking $55 for I believe it is authentic, but I believe this is a new with, without tag. I believe it had a little defect, and as why well, I was able to get my hands on it and bring it at such a good deal. The tag inside, which, what is that going to matter to anybody? Uh, well, maybe, you know, is upside down. So I don't know if you can see that. That tag should be the other way around, okay? But that is a genuine leather, beautiful coral color. You've got the zip here on the outside. You've got a silver tone hardware. Here it is, is its hang tag. Uh, you got a zip on the outside here. And your inside color, like I said again, this is brand new, is a light tan khaki color. Okay? And, uh,. So, beautiful purse. Love the color on that. That is number three, and it is at $55. Oh, I love this one. Love, 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 love. Double strap. Double strap, but you can adjust, you know, to get a longer handle and possibly carry that as crossbody. All right, so number three. Number four, let's see what we've got here, is a navy blue Isaac Mizrahi, Mizrahi. Um, number four, Isaac Mizrahi, and I am asking 65 on this one, which I believe is a great deal. You've got gold tone hardware on it. Uh, you've got the beautiful, pliable, soft, very buttery feel to this one. This one, I can tell, has been carried, and what I see is so minor. There's a little bit of darkening on the leather. I don't know if you can even see it here, and there is this little place right here. I've not attempted to clean it or anything like that. You have got a compartment here on your side, like for a cell phone. One on this side, magnetic snaps. And let's look at its insides here. I'm going to just pull those out. And it's like an olive green color. It may look brown on camera. Here's your Isaac Misrahi uh, authentic authenticity tag or a Talmark tag, whatever you want to call it. So there are some slip covers in here. It is uh, a one compartment. And you've got your zips and everything like that. Other than the places I showed you, I see no issue with this purse. Um, there was one little tiny, you can see here on the very back, right there. Little tiny rubbing off of the leather. Um, its handle looks in great shape. The leather is just a little darker than I am guessing it original was. You can lengthen your strap here. Very nice purse. Okay, that is number four, and this is at 65. Love this one, it feels great too. So let's put our little tag back in there. Okay, next up, I have a black Mikowski. This one is in great shape, guys. Number five, and I am asking $55 for this one. Nice. No issues on its handle. 
beautiful leather, you know, Mikowski. Okay, gorgeous, great shape, lots of life left to this one. Of course, they're just so very well made. You got silver hardware on it. I'll show you the inside. Nice, cool, smooth, and buttery. You've got a leopard print on the inside here with the Mikowski tag right here. There is a, let's pull it out just a little bit here. You can see. You've got a zip and your two slip covers here. So it looks great. This purse is in great shape. And like I said, this is going to last you for a long time. I can crossbody this purse. It is long enough for that. I'm a very tall woman. So if anybody likes the Mikowski, it is at $55. What a great deal. Yeah, that's what I want to be all about. Okay, next up. This is number six. Gorgeous for the fall. A beautiful uh, like maroon color here black this is um, feels like a suede though I don't know if it's faux it is a max New York signature purse gold tone on its accessories you see the inside there you've got some slip pockets here and inside looks great with a zip on the other side. Let's see if we can get you a look in there. Nice, clean. Uh, you got a zip on the back here. I love this one. Very nice, and I am asking $20 for this. $20. Very great shape. Beautiful for the fall. Okay. Alrighty. We're 12 minutes in. I think we're doing good here. Next up, I have a little pink. I tried to bring some different colors for y'all. This is a little pink apartment nine. Super cute little purse. This is number seven, fifteen dollars. This looks brand new, no scratches, no issues, no problems. It's got a little white, the white edge coating, and none of the edge coating is worn. Silver tone on its hardware, pink inside. This is gorgeous. So only asking fifteen. You got a darker and it feels like I'm not sure what type of material like PVC type uh, apartment 9 okay on the little pink and that is at 15 super cute little handbag alright number 7 is a um, brown with gold tone hardware B-R-A-C-I-A-N-O -A -A purse Okay, um, forgive me, I can't pronounce that very well. It is gold inside. I'm asking $15 for this one. It is a large one. There is one little, a couple of little like, like this right here, of its, of its uh, material inside that has a little mark, scuff type place in it, okay? So this is at 15, if any interest, it just needs to get its little form right there. If anybody likes this one. Okay, that is number seven, it is at 15. All right, let's see. That was the purses, I have a couple wallets here. Also, I'm so sorry in my video on my giveaway. I wanted to show you, because I di it didn't pick up good on the video, bad cameramanship. This Liz and Company, it is brand new. This is the giveaway prize. If you choose to take part in that, 
help me to grow my channel, bring some new subscribers, and with the five pound plus of a jewelry assortment, which could be, I'll repeat again, it could be broken, mismatched, little wear, there is lots of wearable, it's like a treasure hunt, five plus pounds in here, and it's just like your burgundy, marooned color, classic little, perfect for the fall, Liz and Company purse, that is the giveaway prize. So, as you, you know, bring subscribers and follow the, you know, stipulations that I have in that giveaway video, your name could be entered for this. And this purse will be given away even if I have only one name in the drawing. If only one of my current subscribers brings another subscriber to my channel and the requirements are met, if it's just one person's name in the drawing, this will be given away on Saturday night. If no one participates, if someone brings a subscriber but they fail to meet the very simple minimal requirements in the giveaway, then I will not give this purse away. I have to have people that participate, right? So I wanted to show that to y'all again. A couple of items here. Let me show y'all a couple of purses. This is by Trust Brand Beautiful Wallet silver tone and um, it is brand new uh, that's what it says this is seems to me like a religious it's backwards it says in quietness and trust is your strength Isaiah 30 15 and I'm asking $12 for this wallet it's like the hard shell formed very cute brand new make a great gift and especially with that little scripture there that it has on it okay please if you do order please put the number of items that I gave you on purses these things I'm not numbering I just need a little description a time stamp uh, something like that that you would like to purchase it this is a dark I don't want to call it I want to call it like a dark brown that little wallet I'll do for $8. Super cute. Looks brand new. Does not have tag. Not sure what you call this kind, guys. That's a silver tone on it. It's hardware. Okay. This, I have two or three things in this little bundle. This is a vintage Daytona 500 Club wallet or checkbook cover here. This is old. It is an absolutely great shape, vintage item. If you like uh, NASCAR, it says genuine leather there. And sorry, that's backwards, but that's what it is. So you're going to get this, a Daytona uh, International Speedway keychain. We'll go with this. Also, I have laying here. Two little like label pins I'm gonna put with this. If I can find them, y'all so sorry. Bear with me a second. Got all my little items laying here. Oh, here they are. Um, and I was asking ten dollars each on these, but I'm including it in the bundle. They're a gold tone, it says 1991 RJRT Taiwan ROC. And it just says Winston Motorsports 20th Anniversary on these gold tone pins. So there's two of those. The keychain, the vintage uh, wallet or whatever this thing is that says Daytona 500 Club. Was there anything else that went in this bundle? No. And these are... These have a nice price attached to them online because they're vintage. This one's in perfect shape. So for this, the two pins and the keychain, I'm asking $40 for. Okay? $40. Alrighty. This was just a cute little, it comes in the box like a little gift. Silver tone. And it says teacher. You see the little like Pandora style? Charms, the apple says number one teacher. 
a little green like glass charm there's a little owl there is a little roller that has one two three on it right here and these are like books right here it says seven and a half inch bracelet there was an amount written here that I blacked out and I hate that but you could actually type a little sticker you could put a sticker or do something there to cover that up if you'd like to gift it and this I'm asking ten dollars on okay ten dollars on this teacher charm bracelet item alrighty here is another wallet I have not seen these before Moschino M-O-S-C-H-I-N-O -S it is a leather it looks to be black and green this is a, a vintage you see these couple little spots here I'm not sure how you clean or take care of that not very noticeable though if anybody likes this at, I'll do this at ten dollars okay this is a pretty cool vintage item and a pricey little name brand there okay okay next up I have a Victoria's Secret scandalous bracelet it is a gold tone and I'm gonna ask fifteen dollars for it very nice I can't fit this on my wrist it is like a clamper um, there's minimal little scratching on it if anybody likes this I love the rhinestone studded here and that is their scandalous collection there and there it just says Victoria's Secret this is at $15 if any interest okay next up I have two uh, a salt and pepper shaker set and these were the cutest little fish they both have their stoppers it says made in China on them here's what they look like and I'm asking 15 for these and they're quite large you can see here in my hand salt and pepper I don't know what kind of fish these are here y'all are these angel fish I'm not sure maybe you'll know if you do leave it in the comments kind of matches my shirt I love that aqua blue color and the yellow and orange in them okay so those are at 15 cute little coffee cup here by I believe Hallmark guys and I apologize this is going to be backwards I'll read it to you got this little lady here and she says all I want for Christmas is peace on earth and really cute shoes. Um, this is at $13 if any interest on this mug. Okay, I hallmark. Super cute. Make a great gift for Christmas time. Okay, this is a vintage Wells Fargo belt buckle, y'all. These are very pricey, um, highly collectible if you're into belt buckles. It has a little writing here on it that probably could be cleaned off like with a, I don't know what, but this is what it looks like. This Wells Fargo vintage, well it says Wells on the back of the money truck here. You can say carried by some horses and I'm asking $35 for this nice vintage Wells Fargo belt buckle $25 is that what I said y'all 25 <laughs> I don't know I think so okay okay this is a fairly cool I think it's pretty cool I thought this might be sterling it looks like a, it is an artesian made piece very cool necklace black seed beaded with um, that's pieces of like little jasper or something here this is very cool I love this and I will do this at $15 if any interest it's just a unique cool piece and uh, please do inquire about length 
if you would like, I'm going to guess that's around 18, 19, 20 inch. Okay. And these are some painted glass here too. Also, if you can see that. Very nice piece. Large bell on that. Okay. Alright, this is a little Sacagawea necklace. Comes with a card. It, it's it's for a Native American nonprofit organization is what it is. So it was a gift for helping the Northern Plains Reservation Aid uh, Foundation. And it's Sacagawea necklace. So it comes with the card. Here is the gold tone necklace. I'm going to say about an 18 inch. You can see your chain there. And it has Sacagawea coin. Okay. And this I'm going to ask $15 for. $15. Alrighty. I have a beautiful, I believe this was a Monet brooch, y'all. This one definitely is. Okay, I didn't write Monet on this one, so if it is, it'll be a plus. This might be unbranded, but they look beautiful together. This one is a Monet. So each of these I would do at $8. Or I will do both together at 15. And they're fairly large size. I really like these. The white faux like uh, acrylic piece here in it. So 15 for the both. They're beautiful, elegant looking brooches. This is a Monet. I believe this one's unbranded. $8 each or 15 for the both. This is LC marked gold tone fish brooch and I will do 10 on it hope you can see it well I love the colors the teal and green yellow and it is marked LC beautiful brooch at $10 all right um okay last thing I'm going to show you because I don't want the video to abruptly cut off it does forgive me this I put together this is a little jewelry making bag okay there are lots of glass beads in here um, lots of uh, items that I put in here all these this is actually a vintage little by fire mountain gems bag of different beads and stuff you can see here show you a little bit what's in there there are some beads here that have gotten started for you. Several of those in there. Some little letter charms covered in rhinestones. I mean, just so much. Also, I have put in here, this looks like a little lamp bead dichroic glass. Uh, this was just a gorgeous, I wish I could have found the other one, copper. Um. Uh, earring with a piece of lapis in it and like I said there are pieces like this that you use for jewelry making I put several several mismatched earrings in here there's more of those beads This was a gorgeous vintage necklace. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I believe there's some quartz in there. That's beautiful. It was broken. I put that in there. Uh, this can be a pin or a little charm. And several things like this. There are more, uh, I don't know, little jewelry. Things you'd use in jewelry. Beads, pendants, charms. Okay, so that is a large bag. For jewelry makers okay and I'm going to ask $20 for it there's lots in there lots 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 of fun in here and that is at 20 the pack of nice beads the pendants the charms everything so I hope somebody will like that and have fun with that that is at 20 there's a lot of supplies in there for you okay 
please again, if you do order, please leave me the cost, a timestamp, or just a very good description. First one, first, first come, first serve for these, y'all. And I look forward to seeing y'all on my Sunday sale. I'm so excited about it. I hope y'all can come and join me. I got lots of brand new nice stuff that I had collected and thrifted and found and searched for prior to my daughter getting sick. Again, I can't express my thanks enough to you guys for your support and your love to me. And wow, 30 minutes. All right, we did good, y'all. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I know I was kind of like down to business here. But I really hope you guys are doing good. And I hope to be able to interact with you again live soon. Well, I did have the five-hour sale on Sunday. I wasn't planning on doing. But that was fun. And uh, hopefully everything here gets back to normal soon. You guys... Oh, y'all. I got another box of craft here. Jewelry making supplies. I'll do this on Saturday. I have some Halloween items for Saturday. All kinds of nice things. You know, Saturdays are variety. So, come and join me for that. Bring a friend. Uh, bring some subscribers and participate in my giveaway. Um, that is a very nice gift that I'm giving away. This very nice new purse with five pounds of jewelry. And I actually just love this bubble mailer. I'll love it when it comes that I can invest. Um, I'm sure those are pricey. Also, I've got some Hot Wheel Lot bundle to show y'all Saturday night. So many nice new things. New scarves, new clothing, some Vermont teddy bear, some awesome plushie, uh, more coach bags, more purses for Saturday. So y'all come, relax, hang out, have a good time with me Saturday night. Okay, thank you so much for watching and supporting my small business. I love you guys. See you Saturday.